What's up guys, girls, and Apple Watch straps? So Geode is a Geometry Rush mod loader. It's pretty cool, there's a lot of stuff. I got a lot of mods. People ask me what mods I have on. All right, well, here they are. And that was all of them. Get a good look. Uh, however, there are infinitely more mods on here that I haven't downloaded. Look at how long it's taken me to scroll through all of these. Look at how many mods there are. These mods vary in quality a little bit. Today I want to, I just want to go through some of them. Um, I think that mods are kind of the way of the future here, so I think it's time that I start milking them for videos. I already did that twice with Globed. So, I, I saw this mod when it first came out called Anti-Lobotomy, which uh, supposedly disables difficulty faces, SFX, song triggers that are related to lobotomies and stuff. Uh, what I was assuming is that this just prevents, like, normal faces from ever just, like, showing up in levels. Um, so we're gonna figure that- we're gonna find out. First things first, let's find a test subject. Let's just look up lobotomy. Wait, what was that one lobotomy boss fight level called? Yeah, we got the normal face particles in the background. And, yeah, okay. Alright, well, let's restart our game and see what's up. Alright, we got our mod on. Let's go play the level and see what's different now. <clears throat> Well, I still saw a normal face, and I still, quite frankly, see the particles in the background. Okay, so it doesn't work. Okay, I think I know what it means when the mod says that it's on a, a name basis. So I presume your level has to have lobotomy in the name for this to work. Let's test this theory. Alright, here's my awesome level. We're gonna upload it with the name Unnamed6, and we're also gonna upload it with the name Lobotomy6. Alright, Unnamed6. Level looks great. <laughs> Wait, that's awesome. I do wish it was possible to detect it automatically somehow. But that's really funny, actually. Oh, sorry to interrupt the video, but you guys know what that song is. Or, actually, maybe you don't, but, uh, it's the sponsor song. It actually means this video is sponsored by Momokai. Please hear me, guys, out. This is a sponsorship you might actually want. Momokai is a company that makes keypads for rhythm games, uh, like Geometry Dash, um, if you view it as one. Uh, I know a lot of y'all recently have been taken kind of by storm by these little guys, so if you haven't gotten one yet, uh, you should try it out. They actually sent me their Tap Trio for free to try out and see if I liked it. And personally, I've really been enjoying it for extremes. Last time to show you that the thing actually works, I played a video of me dying in 94 on low death while using it, but this time for proof that it's goaded, here's a video of me beating low death with it. <gasps> Holy the, the Tap Trio uses open source web-based software to rebind the keys, and the keybinds you set save on the device, so you can use the same config anywhere. Visit momokai.com slash sdslayer to start shopping and pick out your keypad today. Using the link supports me as well, so it would mean a lot to me. And uh, now back to the video. Alright, um, button sound effects. I <laughs> saw and I read the description for this mod a while ago. It kind of sounds awful, so I didn't ever want it. Alright, do I dare? Oh, wait. There's no sounds or anything. Did I do it right? Oh, well, yeah, play in the editor. Sure, 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 let's do that. Um, I have my sound effects on, right? Yeah, they're up. Maybe it just doesn't work or something? Oh, do I have to make my own sound? That's kind of lame, but hold on though, I have an idea. Oh my god. Oh my god, this sucks. <laughs> Dude! Hey guys, welcome to another building video. Uh, we're gonna be- <laughs> we're gonna be building a level today. Um, dude, this sucks! Bro, this is awful! <laughs> oh my god! Alright, I've had enough of that. Congregation jump scare randomly throws you in congregation when you enter a level. I don't know the probability on this, but this sounds funny. You know what else is funny? You hitting subscribe, baby! Yeah! Because we actually demolished 200k and now we're setting our sights on 300k! Let's go! Alright, I'm back to congregation. <laughs> oh. Oh, it just... It puts you... Di directly into... The drop. It doesn't even... 
custom name. This extension changes your name to the one that you want. Custom name. That's me. Custom name. Dude. <laughs> Well, this is a this is a cool mod, I suppose. I would never keep it on though because it would honestly probably just confuse people that are watching my videos. It's already bad enough. My name is the real SD Slayer. So when people want to find my levels, they either end up on this guy's profile or this guy's profile. Yeah, so I don't want to confuse anyone else anymore. But I suppose it's neat. One caveat I notice already is that uh, it doesn't resize the text to uh, like how it should be. So, because my name is real long, this text is real tiny. <laughs> yeah, same thing here. Uh, like, the the play button badge and, like, the I, the info button, are very spaced apart. suppose it's neat, though. Disturbing new bests. Okay, I uh, don't know what that means. Uh, it seems like it's going to replace new best messages with more interesting ones. All right, let's, I don't know, I'll just go play one of my levels that I can get a new best on. I don't really play my own levels that often once I upload them. Maybe you should go back to practice mode. Okay, that's, that's kind of weak. <laughs> okay, that's a new one. Oh, what? You is. Sight readable gameplay in my geometry dash level? Never, never, ever would I allow that to happen. Quote get 309? What is that a reference to? I don't know what that means. I hope it's not anything bad. Come. <laughs> okay, bro. In Soviet geometry dash, spike jumps you. Oh! All right, moving on. A fully customizable FPS counter, sign me up. I'd say this is pretty unobtrusive. I, I, in fact, I'd argue this is how GD was meant to be played. Frames took a little dip there. I was able to tell because the number's so big. God, do I dare install whatever this could possibly be? So it's worth noting that my game has stopped responding, and you can see that it, it stopped responding while loading the mod. Um, I'm not sure if there's a deeper meaning to this, but I feel like it's something I shouldn't totally overlook. Alright man, come on, I thought it was like a funny bit at first, but are you actually, like, j just crash the game if you're gonna, if you're just gonna do this, bro, please. All right, well, I suppose if the joke uh, was to make it so your game doesn't load, that was a pretty funny mod. I saw this mod as well. Um, the, these are like, yeah, they're like pets or whatever. I just need to see how they actually function because it sounds very funny. Oh. I thought that it was going to be more of a they follow my icon kind of thing. I didn't anticipate that they would just be chilling at the bottom of the screen just rolling around we got one of each difficulty so that's nice we got diversity hello friends hey guys man i'm really enjoying this level are you guys you guys liking it you're just gonna keep spinning huh that's fine um yeah So the next mod I decided to try out is Drunk Mode. Um, I already had this one installed, but it was just disabled. It's very silly. It randomly changes the game between 0.85 and 1.15 speed, so the speed is constantly changing. One thing I'd like to see added to this mod is maybe some sort of a text thing on the screen where it shows you what the current speed is, just like a number somewhere. You can see on the on the menu, or here at least, how, uh, how it is. Let's go play a level, like Electrodynamics, with a lot of speed changes. So, yeah, um, I'm sure it's maybe not as easy to tell visually as it is when you're playing, uh, but I think it should be very obvious in the audio what's going on and how awful this is. Okay, never mind. I think it's much more obvious at faster speeds. I'll probably die at that triple speed mini ship coming up, uh, because that's easily the most precise and difficult part of the level, so. Oh my god. Oh, okay, wait, we live for now. Oh, and we're dead. I think I try an extreme. No, I was getting so far. I didn't even make it out of the first part. <laughs> wait, okay. 
We've made it into the second part. No way. <laughs> Bro, this is awful. Oh god. Wait, we're going? No! You know, 20% of the way through an extreme demon ain't so bad in my opinion. Alright, so we got, um, GD Tweaks. So this said, uh, miscellaneous tweaks. I'm not really sure what's up. Um, something is missing here. I just thought something might be different. Oh wait, we have options. Okay, yeah, change shadow text, fire in the hole, yeah, whatever that means. Um, force background ID, whatever, we'll just change this. Move account icon into a corner, sure, whatever. Remove player, remove ground, whatever. Let's just turn on all this stuff. Yeah, let's just, yeah, all of it. Yeah, 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 dude, whatever. I don't even know. I don't know and I don't really care. Hmm, interesting. We're missing a lot of buttons down here. <laughs> Okay, still nothing. This is awful. We're installing it. All right, no immediate side effects because I haven't looked. Oh, search filters, tiny shout, medium wong XW <laughs> and plat. All right, let's, what about some of my levels? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no. No! Oh man, all I need, bro, what do you mean? Hello. What? What? Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so it's N with a vowel after it, I, I think. So if there's a... Yeah, if there's any vowel after an N, I, I guess. <laughs> oh, it doesn't modify the level names, which is funny, because I'm pretty sure that you could. What did he just say? Chambo of time. Oh, it doesn't change his dialogue, though. Oh, it ruins the info tab. That's good to know. We can download the sound twack as well. Well, this was a mistake. Dude, it ruins every other mod as well, bro. Alright, so... Welcome to Evil Geometry Dash. I love this mod, it's very silly. Um, all it does is it, it just makes a bunch of stuff red and puts the word evil before it. If we go to one of my levels, oh, I don't know, maybe fall damage. <laughs> evil fall damage. It makes it all red. Got Evil Bloodbath by Evil Riot. Evil Low Death by Evil Kermal. It's very good, very cool. Just wanted to give that one a quick shout out because I'm a big fan of it. So this is a mod that one of my friends has, uh, he has showed me, it is disgusting. Alright guys, so you know how, um, some difficulty faces have multiple star values assigned to them? Like, easy is all two star, normal is always three star, but hard is four or five, harder is six or seven, and insane is eight or nine. Oh, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Dude... It sucks, dude. I hate it. Get this man off of my screen. Bro. <laughs> Bro. He is cursed. An abomination. This one, this one might be the worst one. I get that it's supposed to try and be a middle ground between insane and easy demon. What is this, bro? Let me just tell you. It used to be so much worse. I'll see if I can find a picture for what this specific face used to look like, but this may have actually, this used to actually be the worst looking thing I've ever seen. Um. Anyways, we're gonna real quick go to the Geode Mod Index and uninstall that. Random event on every attempt, that sounds chaotic. All right, we're back. Whoa, I can't even see because there was a shader. We'll stop the roulette. Rotated gameplay, I can handle that. Oh, it's constant. What? Why is the entire level breaking? I can't believe I'm managing to do this. Oh, geometry dash. Oh, this actually hurts my eyes. Oh my god, this is awful. Oh my god. I'm actually getting nauseous. Oh my god. Oh, that hurt. Oh, okay. 
What does that imply? Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, this is nowhere near as bad as the last one. Oh. Wait, that makes it easy, though. It's just easy. Alright. <laughs> no! I'm not doing this, I'm not doing this, I'm not doing this. Oh my god! Anything else. Okay, I don't know what that means. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we're just skewing the camera over and over again. Okay, that's fine, I guess. This is nowhere near as bad as the rotated gameplay pro. <laughs> this one's too easy, though, so I'll kill myself. I want to see what this means. Oh, okay, so it doesn't constantly change the speed. It's like a random speed for that one time. <laughs> okay. Oh, but it doesn't actually change my hitbox or anything. It's just cosmetic. I mean, that's funny, so <laughs> sure. <laughs> okay, yeah. I like the big wave. Alright, well, GG. I have beaten Dash while being totally massive. And before I move to our final mod, I just want to thank you guys all for watching, especially my channel members, including Village, Xandlal, I guess, Invdu, Arrow, and Dankberries. Thank you guys for much for all support, it means the absolute world to me. And without further ado, the final mod, the mod that's been in plain sight this whole time, right in front of you, and you never even noticed till now. Geometry time. Geometry time. Geometry time.